everyone. Welcome back to Two Minute Tips. Let's get started. Today, we will be walking through how the Customer Success Hub helps you take support out of your email inbox and into one dedicated space where you can both initiate and follow through on your support requests. Get Technical Support allows you to contact the Qualtrics support team by selecting the product area you're working in and how you'd like to be contacted. Hovering over a product option will show you an image and a brief description of the product area. If you're a brand administrator, as in this example, the box at the top will highlight things that only you are able to do for the brand and when to contact your account team. However, if you're a standard user, it will highlight things that you will need to contact your brand administrator for. Once you have submitted a support ticket, you can easily track updates in the My Ticket section. This table gives an overview of your open and closed support tickets. You can quickly search for a specific ticket using its ID or subject line and sort by the created column. If you are a standard user, you can only view tickets you are tagged on, but if you are a brand administrator, you can access all tickets in your brand by toggling to My Organization's Tickets. You can click into individual tickets to view transcripts such as chat conversations or email threads. If your ticket has an open email thread, you can follow up on it right here using the message editor, but keep in mind, you can only respond on tickets submitted by the Qualtrics account you are logged into. Your reply will go straight to the inboxes of our support team and anyone else on the recipient list. The information sidebar will show when the ticket was originally submitted and its current status. If a support ticket has been escalated, you will also see an escalation timeline that shows the status of your issue and when you can expect to see it resolved. And there you have it. Please remember to subscribe to the two minute tip category on the XM community so you don't miss a video.